here we are, got Ron Smith. Can't wait, 500 light time. Let's go inside and check it out. I think it's ready for me on the bench. Let's go, come on. Smile, you're on camera. Oh, the chocolate orange tart, I think. Are you going to the Christmas party, Tom? Probably will. Here she is. She's mine. We've got lots of goodies as well. So the boys here have been amazing. As soon as I walked in, the saw was on the bench ready, which was wicked. Um, and the hexa kit, so the deal that these guys have got at the moment on these, is it on just on these or is it on lots of different stuff? I'll have to double check. I think it was certainly on the MS 500s. Cool. So on the 500s, the deal is you get the hexa kit thrown in, which is 120 quid, I think, for the 25 inch bar. So you get two hexa chains and the super crazy hexa file, which I haven't used yet. So I'm really keen to try that out. And it also means probably on one of the other saws, I can do a bit of a hexa versus RS off, which is cool, but the guys had already fitted a hexa chain for me. They already had some motor mix ready, and they've got this cool little still smart connector thing, which apparently, I don't know, tells me saw stuff on my phone, so I don't know. So we're looking forward to it. This is the saw, it was all ready. Let's go and um, get us started up and cut some wood. Can't wait. But before we do that, I'm just going to give you a little bit more of a flavour of Ron Smith. Um, they are a super cool company, family owned. Um, Mark, who I dealt with, who's the MD, his dad started the company back in 1967, so they've been going for 50 years. They've got a site in Hereford, a site in Worcester, and they serve the country nationally with uh, mail order. They are super competitive on mail order. They're the cheapest you'll find. Um, but their service is just second to none. Wonderful family-owned business. Like I said, there's, there's guys there that have worked there for 40 years, and that says everything to me about what sort of company they are. Um, they, they do everything as well you could want, garden equipment-wise. Um, saws, obviously, full range of steel, full range of husky, full range of echo, um, lots of axes, all the PPE from both companies. Um, they sell Aspen, they sell steel motor mix, big range of mowers. So they do ride-ons, sit-ons, lawn tractors, anything you could want. So go and give them a follow. Go and give them a follow on all the socials and on Instagram. They're super active on there. Um, and tell them James sent you. That would be awesome. Thank you ever so much. Here's another little aside as well. 661 is only half a horsepower more, and it's a kilo heavier than a 500i. So I've just got back. Um, sorry, you're on a screen just by me. Um, just got back, um, and I'm still a little bit in shock, really, that in the back of the car is a new 500i! Can't believe it. Um, still, I haven't started the saw, I haven't touched the saw, although I was interested to learn, still run every single straw on the line, and they check the chain break of every single saw on the line. So somewhere, there's a little database with serial number, a little chain break check, and all sorts of stuff. So well done still, I like that. Um, I've just got some thank yous, really. Um, the Ron Smith, the guys at Ron Smith, please go and give them some love on their Instagram. Um, Ron Smith and Co. 
go and find them on Instagram, go and find them on YouTube. Um, they've kindly put a post up about me. I didn't ask them to, they just did it. Um, they've put a post up on Instagram, go and give it 10,000 likes. Um, and yeah, they, they were amazing. Every single person at that shop was helpful, friendly. They are the very epitome of a family run, you know, there's, there's guys there that have worked there for 35 and 40 years. If that doesn't say everything about what sort of company they are, then I don't know what else I can say, really. So thank you, thank you, thank you to those guys. They've just been incredibly accommodating and friendly and ev everything there was wonderful. The saw was ready. Fantastic. Um, and thank you so much to all of you subscribers that bought saws. When I had this crazy idea of going and buying a 500i as a benchmark saw to, to test other saws against, and I thought, you know, it coincided with the wife having come in and counted a few saws and we got to 30 or something. I know which is a rookie number, but for wives, it's quite a big number. Um, and yeah, I thought, Do you know what? Get rid of a few saws get one that I can benchmark some stuff against. Win-win. But, you know, the buying of stuff is easy, isn't it? The selling is not so easy, but you guys have made it so easy. You know, I've just passed stuff on at what I bought it for. You guys seem to have been happy. Every single guy that's bought a saw from me has said, is it going towards the 500i? Am I helping towards the 500i and all of that? And you guys have made it happen. So thank you so, so much. Um, you you are amazing. You, you amaze me in the comments. Every, every video I make, I learn something in the comments. Um, you've just amazed me with this. I'm, it's, it's a tiny, I'm a tiny little channel and a tiny little guy in, in a tiny little corner of the world. Um, and yeah, you guys come on and comment and you've helped me out towards this goal and it's been amazing. So truly thank you so much. Um, I think I'm probably going to wrap this video up here and then because it's the end of the day now, it's raining. I was hoping to do a bit of a bigger video with first start and first cuts and, and all that stuff. Um, but we've run out of light to do that today and there's a big storm in the UK as well today. So I'm going to wrap this video up here and put it out so you can see the, that I have actually got the, the saw um, and then we'll do the next video that you see on this will be first start, a really good look around, a really good look around the hexa chain and the file and the kit you get and the instructions and we're going to geek out on all that stuff um, and then we'll start it up let it absorb the atmosphere and all of that. And then we will get it in some wood, which we're really dying to. Hopefully if this weather holds off, then um, we can get cutting again this weekend, but it's pretty stormy and crappy. So we'll see how it goes. Keep your fingers crossed that we can do that. How'd you like my new timber sports cap? Um, and yeah, so other than that, thanks very much guys. Um, do give us a like and a subscribe if you're not already liked and subscribed. Um, and do go and find Ron Smith's YouTube channel um, and give them some love and say thank you very much for helping James out and just being such nice people. So yeah, go and see them if you're local. Go and see them in their stores. They've got, as you've seen, uh, they've got a massive workshop. Um, they're just super friendly people. Just go and see some saws. They've got axes and saws and log handling equipment and all the PPE equipment. And also, I didn't realize it was such a big thing in this area, lawn tractors. And they've got the, um, oh, I keep forgetting the name of them. You know, they're like the quads with the pickup truck bit in the back and all sorts of stuff. Just honestly, go and see them. And if you're not local, go online. They're super good prices. They've got, I've been around their warehouse. They've got all the stock um, and they've got a really nice, you know, they've got a really good workshop as well. So if you need stuff fixing, go and see them as well there. Thanks so much for watching guys. And um, look out for the next installment where we'll be getting it fired up and we'll get it in some wood. Cheers, take it steady. Thank you.